What's up guys, Hong from Chi Fitness. And uh, in this video, we're gonna talk about uh, things that you can do for uh, recovery, a faster recovery, right? So this video is actually for a buddy of mine's, right? A, uh, a teammate. And um, so he asked me, uh, well, what can you do to recover faster, right? So I'm making this video for him. I figure, why, why not share with you guys too at the same time instead of just me texting back and forth and answering questions that way, right? Because, <laughs> hey, oh, busy guy, so. All right, so a couple of things here. I'm gonna show you the supplements. The main thing, the main thing, right, that, uh, that I wanna push in this video is Epsom salt bath. Epsom salt, sorry. So what it is is that you take a bath with this, right, Epsom salt, and, um, it definitely helps you to recover faster. It relaxes your muscle, uh, and then of course, uh, what does it do again? It has a whole bunch of stuff in it. Uh, I think some magnesium and all that. And it just, it helps tremendously with recovery. This is magic. Mike Tyson used to do this back in the day uh, when he was young, right? I read that in his autobiography. Um, and yeah, man, like he would, uh, he was a beast. Like, he, I think he was fighting like grown, uh, a grown ass men at 13 years old in, in, in a boxing ring, in boxing matches, you know? So it was nuts. And then he was, uh, he, was, he was training a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. And when he was completely ruined and tired and you know, this is what he would do. Epsom salt bath, right? So what you do is uh, you buy this. I'll put a link down below. Um, and you can buy this off the uh, off Amazon or whatever you know um, pharmacy or or what do you call it guy what do you guys call that in the states uh, health yeah pharmacy whatever okay so that's the that's the main thing right that's that's not, I wouldn't say it's the main thing it's the thing that helps uh, really quickly really like you feel it right away right like as soon as you get out of uh, so you put the water as hot as you can and you put about two, um, well, you follow in the instructions here, about, it says here about uh, one half a cup, you know, in, uh, in every four liters, uh, blah, 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 whatever. I just take like two big, uh, two big cups, two really big cups, and then I throw it in there, or not even, I just take it, I just, you know, whatever. Obviously, don't, don't waste the whole thing in one, for one bath, but, you know, it makes a big difference. Like once you get out of this, uh, let's say after your training, after a long days of training, so you do this before you go to bed. So it helps you to relax, helps you to sleep, helps the muscles, there's magnesium in it, goes through your, your pores and all that. So it's really, really, really good, right? And we're all deficient in magnesium. So, you know, this is definitely uh, a very good thing. It helps you recover really fast. You feel really good afterwards, really, really good. So. That's the main thing I want to push in this video, but then there's other things that you have to do that are less obvious, right? This one, it's like instant, uh, instant recovery kind of thing, right? You're gonna feel really good afterwards, really relaxed. If you do it right before bed, then boom, you'll have a really good sleep too. Um, and sleep, and that brings me to sleep. Sleep is really important, right? If you, you gotta sleep between anywhere between seven to nine hours a day, a night, I mean and like sleeping is like the ultimate form of recovery right so if you're not getting enough sleep you could do a lot of little things uh right but if you get the big things wrong okay like all the rest of it isn't gonna mean shit you know that's the bottom line so you really have to dial in your sleep your nutrition your exercising and all that well i mean okay we're talking about recovery so your nutrition your exercise uh your your sleep right your hydration levels so you gotta drink water we're talking about uh two to three liters easily a day that's outside of like what you drink when you're actually working out right uh your body you lose about three liters of water like a day anyway uh when you um uh just in general through perspiration right just through sweating for, for sweat like not not like profusely sweating but just throughout the whole day you lose about three liters so you gotta have that's why they, that's why you gotta drink like two three liters right if you're exercising, well, whatever you drink, whatever, you have to replace whatever you lost during exercise. So that's extra on top of it. So that's why hydration is super important. Sleep, I mean, your body gets rid of toxins when you sleep, right? Uh, in your brain and in your muscles and all that. So if you're not sleeping enough, then uh, you know, you're, you're doing yourself a disservice. You're not gonna recover as well. And then when it comes to nutrition, well, obviously you have to eat foods that are anti, uh, that don't cause too much inflammation. So what causes inflammation? 
Well, generally speaking, what causes inflammation is highly processed foods. So anything um, uh, like if you if you chuck the bars all day, well, you're causing a lot of inflammation in your body, right? So, or if you eat like uh, crazy stuff like uh, like pasta, pro like you know processed foods, just fast food, junk foods, whatever you know. You guys know what I mean. Like fast foods. Uh, um, so anything that's the opposite of whole foods. There you go. So if you eat a lot of processed food, fast food and stuff like that, it's gonna cause a lot of inflammation and you're gonna recover faster, right? So that's another thing. So we talked about hydration, we talked about uh, um, uh, nutrition, and of course, uh, sleep, okay? So then one thing, like I said, this Epsom salt thing here, and uh, I wanna show you guys another supplement that I, uh, that I started taking. Instead of a multivitamin, I take this all green supplement and um, yeah, it's more natural, right? And you get uh, you get all the same stuff and more, right? And it's natural, right? It comes from veggies. So, and, and to be honest, guys, you gotta eat a lot of veggies, but it's hard to eat, to be constantly eating. You know, like, we're not cows, we have other things to do and to just, uh, you know, like, like uh, spend our day just chewing on veggies and grass and whatever, you know, well, not grass, because we can't, we don't have the enzyme to digest it, but, so that's why this is what I recommend instead of a uh, multivitamin, right? Of course, your omega threes, right? Unless you eat a shit ton of fish, omega three, you need this, okay? And even if you, even if you eat a lot of fish, take it anyway, okay? And vitamin D three, okay? This is uh, this is basic supplements that uh, that everybody needs that I recommend to all my clients because if you don't take this, like your 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 body, you're definitely deficient in all of this. Okay, not the Epsom salt here, let me just put this now, but you're definitely omega-3, this right here, right, the all greens um, uh, powder supplement, and of course this uh, vitamin D3. Now there's a bottle here that I'm all out of, so I have to uh, I have to order some more. It's called a ZMA, zinc and magnesium. So it's a zinc and magnesium supplement uh, put together. So I take them together because I'm, I'm lazy. Like all of this I take at one shot, right? Uh, not the Epsom salt bath. This is for when I actually need it. I don't do this all the time. I only need, do this when I'm really, really sore, right? Boom. These these three things here, I take this in the morning, right? And at night, I take something called ZMA. So it's a supplement. Um, it's a zinc and magnesium supplement. And it's really important because everybody's deficient in it. And if you take that, you're going to see, you're going to sleep better. So that I actually take at night. I take like three caps at night. Boom. And you sleep better. You recover better. Uh, you gotta remember that uh, zinc and magnesium, like especially magnesium, it's involved in, in like over, I think like 300 chemical processes in your body. So if you're deficient in magnesium, that's like 300 things that can go wrong, that aren't optimal. Think about that. And zinc is like 100 or some crazy shit like that. So that's in total, those two things are like uh, involved in like 400, 400 processes in the body, right? And you're deficient for sure. You know why you're deficient? because the soil is deficient. You're supposed to get this from food, so you would have to eat the right foods, the right amount to get all of that, right? And nobody eats the right amount of food they're supposed to eat. Nobody eats enough variety, so like forget that, right? And on top of that, even if you did, right, the soil is so depleted because we farm our soil so hard for, and, and, and the funny thing is most of it is, is, for, is for animal feed. <laughs> Right, like 70% of it is for animals, and only 30% is for humans, but anyways. So, what happens is that the soil is so depleted, like you're not getting enough uh minerals, man, from your food, right? That's why you got to supplement, man, you know. So, like, I used to not believe in supplements, I used to, to tell myself, ah, oh, no, you could get away with just eating and sleeping, and yes, but it's not optimum, and um, I mean. As I get older, I, you know, I'm more health conscious and stuff like that, and I'm more careful because, you know, like it it, it affects, you know, like uh, your performance and how you, how your body's gonna look, how you're gonna feel, and uh, how you're gonna perform in life in general. And uh, yeah, I want to stay young for a long time too, right? So that's why uh, I do all of this stuff, right? Okay, so just to reiterate, I'll put a link down below. Epsom salt bath, man. This is instant, instant. Okay instant uh instant recovery you feel so relaxed so good after this right 
After that, there's uh, don't forget, uh, there's sleep, there's uh, your nutrition, right? And of course, there's hydration, and of course, all of these beautiful things here, these supplements here. So the, you have the all greens uh, supplement, right? Powder. You have your omega three. You have your vitamin uh, D three, and you have the ZMA, which I don't have here, but I'll put a link down below anyway. And oh, one last tip: you sh if you're not stretching, you should be stretching. Stretching is super important. It's gonna help with recovery too. So give that a shot, especially this one. Like I know it's a lot of stuff, right? But uh, this one, like if I had one thing to recommend to, uh, to my buddy, right? To my buddy Nick there, this would be it, buddy. You know, start with this and maybe later on, uh, you know, like let's say, for example, if money is an issue, right? Then this, this stretching, sleeping, water, you know, and uh, anyways, we'll talk more at, uh, you know, when we see each other. All right, peace guys. Oh, like the video, subscribe, um, you know, share, of course, comment below what you guys do. What do you guys do for, uh, for recovery and all that? Uh, what's your, what's your biggest, uh, what's the thing that works the best for you? That's what, uh, that's what I want to know. Okay guys, peace.